And on this Tuesday, he was elected by the voters in Georgia as the insurance and fire safety commissioner. Tonight, Jim Beck has been indicted for stealing $2 million in an insurance scheme and accused of using some of that money to fund his campaign. The feds say Jim Beck created fake companies for years. Caitlin Ross is on the story for us tonight. A powerful position does not shield you from the sins of your past criminal activities. Justice and rule of law will catch up to you eventually. U.S. Attorney B.J. Pock laid out the case against Georgia Insurance Commissioner Jim Beck. The federal grand jury alleges Beck had his friends create fake companies to work with the Georgia Underwriting Association. Those companies would submit fake invoices, and then the money they earned would be funneled into Beck's personal bank accounts. He allegedly used that money to fund his campaign for state office, pay off bills, fix his rental properties, and even pay his taxes. The investigation has been going on for 10 months, but Beck was just elected to the statewide office four months ago. I'm here today to assure you that my office will expend all resources necessary to hold those accountable who seek to enrich themselves through fraud and deceit, no matter who they are. The U.S. attorney says Beck was under investigation during the election, but the investigation was ongoing and they were still gathering evidence. Right now, there is no proof that the alleged fraud happened while he was serving as the state insurance commissioner. And the allegations contained in the grand jury indictment do not touch upon his current role.